Keeping it local this evening, Kiwani will break ground on a $4.2 million harbor improvement project this Friday. This project has been years in the making and will focus on redoing a section of the seawall. And Local 5 Steve Den found out why this project is so important for that community. I'm a lifetime resident of Kiwani. I'm born and raised here. And this is probably the biggest project and the most exciting thing that's hit the city in my lifetime. I'm extremely proud to be part of it, and I'm very happy for what it can mean for our city moving forward. The main piece to the harbor revitalization, putting in a new seawall. The seawall is actively failing. It's falling into the harbor in places. You know, there's a real need to get this project done. The project will also give some much needed TLC to the exterior of the Kiwani Pierhead Lighthouse. It's really exciting what's going to happen with the lighthouse. And there's plans for green space. It's funded 100% uh, by the, the state. It means economic development. For a $4.2 million project, Kiwani never would have been able to afford. It seemed like an impossible task to get funding for that project. Fishing is a major part of the Kiwani economy, but Tom Clayman told me the challenge is getting fishermen's families to visit. We're, you know, we're hoping for a developer that's going to come in there and bring something that's really going to draw people to that harbor area. Possibly a hotel, restaurants on the water there, some shops. And the key to getting a developer starts with the seawall. You know, this is one of the most beautiful places on the lakeshore, and I think this project is really going to put a little bit more shine on the dime. But there's no denying the beauty of Kiwani. Keeping it local in Kiwani, Steve Dent, Local 5 News. Thank you, Steve. And Governor Scott Walker will be on hand for the groundbreaking on Friday. And the people of Kiwani appreciate the legislature.